These days, growers are more conscious of pesticide spraying, especially when it comes to overspraying their crops. ARS researchers and their partners have developed and tested an innovative laser-guided sprayer to help growers apply precise amounts of pesticide. Dr. Heepin Zhu is an ARS agricultural engineer who led the development of the precision spray technology. He works at ARS's Application Technology Research Unit in Worcester, Ohio. There are so many benefits with this new technology. It significantly reduces pesticide use and waste. With the retrofit kit, growers themselves can upgrade their own sprayers to precision sprayers rather than buying new sprayers. And spray manufacturers do not need to change their spray designs either. The precision sprayer uses high-speed laser scanning technology to image tree structures and then controls the spray outputs of an air-assisted variable rate spraying system to match targeted tree structures. So basically, it scans the individual trees and then tells the sprayers where and how much to spray. ARS technician Adam Clark gave me a tour of the sprayer. The LiDAR sensor, which is here, and what this is is, is the eye of the sprayer. So this, this LiDAR sensor lets the sprayer see the targets and will spray not only according to whether or not it sees a tree, but also can change the rate based on the density of the tree or the density of the leaves. Speed sensor right here keeps track of the speed of the sprayer. The faster you go, the more liquid you need to put out. In the tractor, we've mounted a touchscreen computer and a switch box for the operator to have easy control over the power of the system and also be able to select each side of the sprayer. I watched the precision sprayer in action at Ballman Orchards in Rittman, Ohio, not too far from Akron. Speaking of Akron, this machine has LeBron James potential for sure. The sprayer can treat one to six rows of trees at a time. Conventional spray application technology requires excessive amounts of pesticide for effective control. But the precision sprayer characterizes the presence, size, shape, and foliage density of target trees and applies just the right amount of pesticide in real time. I spoke with Bill Ballman, owner of Ballman Orchards in Ohio. He said this intelligent sprayer is a game changer for his business. We farm close to 260 acres, mostly apples and peaches. And for the last 35 years, we've used the conventional sprayer. We started using the intelligent sprayer that was retrofitted on my sprayer. I feel that I'm saving 50% of my chemical spray or chemical cost. We have not had any difference in pest control. I really like it on the peaches because the first few years, you know, you might have eight, 10 feet in between your trees and you can't shut your conventional sprayer off between each tree. You know, it automatically shuts off where there's no tree or in a block where you might have trees that are different sizes or maybe missing a tree. It will shut off there so you're not spraying where there's not a tree. Okay, let's talk numbers. In field tests across the country on a variety of crops, the precision sprayer reduced pesticide use between 30 and 85%, reduced ground loss by 90%, and reduced spray drift up to 87%. That's the amount of chemicals lost in the air. Growers can save between $50 and $800 per acre, depending on the crop types. Savings aside, tests show the precision sprayer was just as effective at pest control than traditional sprayers, and less spray means fewer chemicals sprayed on our delicious apples. It also protects our critical pollinators that help these orchards thrive. Think bees, butterflies, and other beneficial insects. This new system is the product of a decade's worth of research and development in collaborations with many research and extension educators. The Intelligent Spray System was commercialized by Smart Guided Systems in 2019 under the name Smart Apply. Growers across the United States and in other countries have upgraded their sprayers with Smart Apply, and they're already reaping the benefits. It saves growers money, it is good for our ecosystem, and it offers a sustainable and environmentally responsible approach to protecting crops.